My name is Dejan Tesfigurgis, and I live in Brooklyn, New York. So you're on the other dating apps. Why'd you join Vaxmash? Good afternoon. I'm Lester Holt with a smirk that says I have news that will ruin your day. We now go live to Black Brunch, where Shaquille O'Neal is splitting the bill. Shaq's got the bill, because I'll put my name on anything I can get an endorsement from. From my several own Shake Shacks, to my house in Shackapuco, and of course Radio Shack. And make sure while you're eating with me, call the general and save some time. Excuse me, server, who can I give this Shaq cash money? Shaq, you, you so fat, you order everything on the menu except thank you come again. Let me explain something, because we are all gonna kick in for this bill, particularly all y'all athletes throwing unwarranted shade at the table. Because off the bench, we all had appetizers and pancakes that were the greatest God ever created. Um, hold on, boo-boo. You better shut your mouth before a cat shuts it for you, you syrupy nigger. We all know that cat's bread is stacked higher than a motherfucking French toast factory. I will kick in for a Chicago-style pan pizza that I flick with pickle juice for flavor. Look, somebody better rush and slap down a credit card like I was rushed and slapped at the Academy Awards. It was a G.I. Jane joke. You know, at The Daily Show, when we order such a variety of food items, what we like to do is make our checks separate. But equal. We'll be right back. <laughs> satire, satire. I mean, me and Jordan, we had a show on Comedy Central. Even before that, on Mad TV, we love some good satire, don't we, Jordan? I'm just saying, I, I can't seem to work with the guy since he went out to direct films. All I'm saying, all I'm saying, Jordan, is direct one episode of Schmigadoon. Son of a... Now, as a black horror director, my burned hash browns are a microcosm of African Americana. When you think about it, we as homo sapiens are merely collections of stars over billions of years in the galaxy. And of those stars, I'm the biggest. I will exclusively be paying for my three cosmos. Neil deGrasse Tyson, congratulations. Your tweets have made you cheap. Westworld and Hunger Games has made an unequivocal hunger unfulfilled by these eggs under easy. Like my personality, let us make this bill an even split. Now the good brother Jeffrey speaks of an unjust, unfair, and unwarranted distribution of edible economics amongst the proletariat. Mm. See, that's how you talk to a soft ass motherfucker like Larry David to get a motherfucking bill paid. <laughs> Must be tripping, Mr. the way that goes something smelling snake. I pay all the bill snakes and fulfill my purple drink. <laughs> Wait. Is it? Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Rather be brunching and stuck in them dreams. I know all of y'all want to try my poutine. Uh. Brunching on the weekend like usual. Yeah. Suckle up, sick fucks, white claws, and club sandwiches. Took the Ambien, I'm my Ambien's ambidextrous. Ha! Ah, see, he painted cats, but double lap him, double platinum, had him, doubled over turkey burgers, doubled up and down and dash and derelict him on and lick get drunk, sip it quick and do the round to me, 33, 28, no center. Lights down and they break and stay. Over tip, grunt to it, they, huh? I'll be serving another 40 years in this lifeless cubicle till I run out of sick days and die. I started slinging spreadsheets at 14 years old. Me and my boys thought it'd be fun to get us some internships. That's when I got hooked on LinkedIn notifications. And now my network is so strong, I look forward to happy hour with the same motherfuckers that make me drink in the first place. Now let your heads forward and pray. Our algorithm, emoji in the DM followed be thy fame. I like and tag, secure the bag. Cross platform and in the cloud. Refresh us today on notifications and forgive us our unfollows as we forgive those who left us on red. Double tap. Welcome back to What Kind of African? The game show that asks white travelers to name a specific African nation because Safari, Wakanda, and Pride Rock are not real places. Just once I want the full spectrum of my sexuality and my humanity as a black man to be represented. Look at some of my titles. Beautiful blonde Midwestern beauty versus black guy. Le mille français fait du sexe avec monsieur black. 
Harry Gilf Squirter with Big Niggardly, which I think is a typo. Auto play. Hi, CBS. Rest of the team, Paramount Showcase in my comedy dreams As we peep the scene, let me come clean I'm on my honeymoon, so this music video's gonna be lean Let me start with a bit of introduction Dajan Tesfakyorgas is my name up in the function Dad's Eritrean, mom's Mississippian Grew up a blue kid in the red state of Wisconsin With black power conversations, multi-language indulation Creative realization came from painful, scary situations Family dealt with schizophrenic undulations, complications Pop slept for a job with no memory Consultations, but always saw my brothers laugh and living color fabrication. Sister was my other half, all that decorations. Dad cracked at norms, OJ blows, mom southern sand. Beijing, get my purse off the floor. Never leave your money low. Move to Nebraska and Iowa life inconsistency. Comic view kids in the hall. Chris Rock Conan comforted me. A way of coping. See creation so I'm never alone. And eventually I went and picked up a saxophone. Turned to a love of jazz and black stories all within. Joshua Redmond, Bird, Sunny singing spiritual hymns. Denied from top conservatories and I felt I failed till the Minnesota college gave me a scholarship and said sale. So great, take that. The full tuition, it was clear. Buried my head in music and business and up my tear. Endeared, endured, pretending life was pristine only made new friends who Sorry, didn't interrupt my, my routine. routine gig 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 then talk to the crowd hey, lit doing? lit 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 my public speaking got hey, proud wig 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 took them off to be free i can do anything as long as i stay me when i finished college started a software company replacing cd sent to music conservatory watch up admission software was my life for five years clients in okay. juilliard and them schools that left me in tears the 70 hour work weeks were just normal then peaked at 450k a year but i only kept 10 could have kept more, but I couldn't have those tough conversations. So burying in work led to my deep depression. So started stand up, so the company took therapy, took UCB and NYC, sketch on a pit team and day jobs, code switching, nine to five, stabbing into my joy like a splinter. Dajin's day job working at the World Trade Center. Kept on sketch shows and character, but a hard pill to swallow. 2019, I was booed off stage at the Apollo. Till the pandemic hit and my job was bought by Microsoft. I was the top seller, but they still told me to fuck off. Three pilots and two specs later, I keep creativity above. Acted right on my YouTube channel, married my love. Freelance right for PBS, love hip-hop improv entirely. Please let me ask, is there any reason you wouldn't hire me?